Leaving home is hard. Not least of all, because mom can't schedule your appointments for you anymore. That, along with being broke, being afraid of a misdiagnosis, and having no idea how insurance works, keeps many students from seeking out medical care, even if they really need it. This leads to slipping grades, worsened injuries and illnesses, lowered attendance, and even getting other people sick. I do, I do know a few friends who are uninsured. This struggle to get help has only been exacerbated by the pandemic, where clinics and emergency departments are more full and bank accounts are more empty than normal. Um, if even the slightest cough comes up, uh, snotty nose, anything like that, I'll get very nervous. Despite the struggles the pandemic has brought us, healthcare centers are still doing their best to provide quality care to everyone. Yes, they, every one of them should have some sort of um, assistance. Uh, if you do not have insurance, there's always um, grants that you can write for, scholarships you can write for, or most hospitals have like a certain a level uh, percentage that they would ask you to pay. Knowing where to go and when can also be really stressful. Is it bad enough to go to the emergency department? Should I drop by the urgent care, call my doctor, grab some DayQuil from the Walgreens? A simple way to help alleviate these issues before they begin is to talk to your guardians about your health care regimen. Hey, Especially if you routinely um, have medical treatment I'm like an appointment. or take prescription medication. Work with them to find care in Stillwater and get familiar with hey, their insurance, um, especially I'm setting up an appointment. For News OSU, I'm Diane Schwartz.